Lee, Robin. Hi. 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 H
You know, I, um, I, I really think that I, I should feel badly, though, because I was carrying all those packages. You weren't carrying the bags, ma'am. That's not the point, Jennings. The point is, is I don't want that guy, you know, showing people that I'm, I'm nothing but a, a, a rich and frivolous woman who doesn't have anything better to do than shop. Well, what else do you do, dear? Well, Mother Quartermain, actually, you know, today I had a meeting with the um, architect set up to go over the plans for our new house, and I was going to try on all my new clothes and see how they fit, but... Well, I, um, I think perhaps that cameraman may be coming by and I should go freshen up. Jennings, run along, take all those bags of stairs for me, please. Very good, ma'am. Oh, Mother Quartermain, I hope you don't mind me saying, but darling, you too, could you possibly change your clothes? You know, maybe... Excuse little... me? Change? Never mind. Um, Tracy and Ashton, try not to embarrass me, won't you? Jennings, come on. Mother, I don't think you can put much credence. What if this TV thing is real? Well, I think about a dash up doesn't put on my smoking jacket. You know the one with the Ashton crest? No, you idiot. What if she goes on the air and starts blabbing about the diamonds? Oh, good Lord. What's up? Here. Is that the will? He disinherited Olivia, leaving Julian and Evan Jr. as his sole heirs. What I thought. So with Julian dead. Evan, it's all the diamonds. It's perfect. All right, Scott. I did my part, produce the will. Where's the heir? He's on his way. The sooner the better. You know, there's really no reason we have to wait until the 30th. Well, I couldn't agree with you more. It's just that it's going to take some time to get over here, that's all. Why? You too cheap to spring for a ticket on the Concord? <laughs> Need a break. Now give me some facts. As a matter of fact, why don't you and I go back to my office and let's talk about how we can speed this thing up? Well, I'd love to, except I got a meeting right now. Our new consultant at ELQ. You probably know her. Cheryl Stansberry? Cheryl? Sure. Yeah. No, I don't think so. Why? Hmm. Well, she used to go out with Julian for some time. You remember, don't you? Yeah. yeah, I'd forgotten shit. But then, I never really had very much to do with Julie. Well, listen, I'll, I'll tell her that she said hello. I don't. I mean, I wouldn't. She might not appreciate being reminded of the Gerard. Yeah, can't really blame her. I'll see you around. I thought I'd just wait for him in here. Well, listen, I'm glad I tracked you down because that man called for you again. That's the fifth time this morning. And he still won't leave a message? No. All he does is leave his number and say to tell you that Mr. Broxton called. Thank you, Mary. Listen, would you like me to do something about it? I will. No. I can take care of it myself. 